Hey guys, welcome back to the LARP guy. Today we're gonna try something new. Uh, I'm actually gonna do a forging video, but not a, a knife video or anything like that. There's plenty of those all over the internet. Uh, today what we're gonna do is we're gonna try and forge a steel wand. So I've got a piece of 5 16 inch steel rod here, round rod. Uh, we're gonna cut it down to about 12 inches and try and forge a wand out of it. So here's the trick guys. We're not gonna be using my big forge today. We're gonna be using a small, simple setup that anybody could do for probably about uh, 30 bucks. Uh, most expensive thing is gonna be a torch here. This is about 25 bucks at any home improvement store. And then we've got a ceramic fire brick here. Uh, it was actually one brick to begin with. I cut it in half and then put some grooves in it. And these are pretty easy to pick up, fairly cheap. Uh, you want to make sure to get the kind of spongy chalky ones and not a full hard ceramic brick like this one. So I've just got my propane torch set up in a simple drill vise. That way it's got a solid base. And I'm just going to sit and let that warm up for a minute. Got a nice heat on the tip. We're just gonna kind of square that off and draw it out to a point. There you have it, a little bit square. Now we're gonna heat it up again. Then we're going to continue to draw it out, flatten out the rest of the bar, and then we're gonna round the tip back off into a round point. Alright, I think I've got the point rounded off like I want to and thinned out just enough. And to do that, I've just been rotating the wand in my hand while I've been hammering it to round off all the edges. It's still a little rough, but I kind of like it that way. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go back and we're going to flatten out one side here. Technically two, top and bottom. I'm not really going to hit the sides too much. Uh, because I'm going to twist it and I want it to be nice soft lines in my twist, not a real hard line that you would get off of a square rod. And then just checking to make sure everything is mostly straight. And back into the fire. Alright guys, now we got the wand squared off and drawn out just about where we want it. It is about 13 and a quarter inches right now. So now what we're going to do is we're going to start just after the taper for the point and make a few marks. Probably about one every inch. Now what we're going to do is we're going to heat it up 
we're gonna start to twist it. Once we twist it, it comes out a little crooked. Just bring it over the anvil, smack it with this little piece of wood I've got. That way I'm not marring any surfaces. So guys, the cool thing about running a little uh, little setup like this is you can heat specific points of your work, which is cool for an, a project like this where I'm twisting small sections here and there. Um, and you can make a small knife inside of this thing, but it's really not gonna be good for anything else. I mean, you can do small trinket stuff, which is fun and it's cheap to build and it's an easy building block. And so now I'm going to come in, try and cool off the tip of this so I don't mess up anything I've already done. All right, now we're actually going to try and twist in the opposite direction we, we did the first time. If we can get these to clamp on now that I've kind of rounded pieces of it off. Yeah, I'm not, I don't look like it's going to go. That over there is Wiley, and Wiley loves to chase balls. And he will get underneath my feet all the time, so that I'll throw it to him. And I have this thing. Makes life really easy for me. All right, guys. So now we have all of our twists in. Let's see if I can get. I had to actually focus. Running backwards and forwards. Um, now we're just gonna go through cleanup. Don't really need to sand any of this, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wire wheel it all, and then I'm gonna buff it on a buffing wheel. So here you go guys, the finished wand. It's just over 13 inches, under 13 and a quarter. Um, it's fun making it, I hope you guys like watching the video. Uh, feel free to like, subscribe, and if you guys want to see anything else, feel free to leave a comment down below. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Bye.